You can now create your own digital double that not only sounds like you but also looks and moves exactly like you. This digital avatar can say anything you want and even speak in different languages. This is a game changer for many creators as it saves a significant amount of time. With this, you no longer need to film yourself every single time. Instead, you can produce entire social media videos using only your avatar. This is MDMZ and today I'm gonna show you how to create your own AI avatar. To begin, you need to record a video of yourself speaking to the camera for 2-5 to five minutes. This recording will be used to train the AI on your voice, facial expressions, and overall body language. You can film with either a camera or your smartphone, but make sure you use high resolution and record in a quiet environment. You can include your hands in the video, but keep your gestures generic and below chest level. Feel free to discuss any topic in the language you are comfortable with. Most importantly, relax, be yourself, and maintain eye contact with the camera the entire time. You can check the description box for additional tips on how to film this. You will also find a ready-to-use script that you can read out during the recording. And I suggest using a teleprompter so you can maintain eye contact. Now, if you're like me and don't have much experience talking in front of the camera, I totally get how you feel. I've only done it a few times, and each time it makes me really nervous. One thing that really Help me out is this class by Chris Brooker on Skillshare, the sponsor of today's video. Watching this class, I learned how to manage my fear, get prepared, and feel a lot more confident on camera. Chris shares some amazing tips and techniques that truly made a difference for me. What's great about this class is that it's perfect for everyone, especially beginners. And trust me, this is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to what Skillshare has to offer. Skillshare is an incredible community of learners and creators with high quality classes on topics like photography, content creation, and more, all taught by industry experts. They've got classes for all experience levels, so if you're already comfortable in front of the camera but want to learn more about lighting or camera settings, Skillshare has you covered. And if you're one of the first 500 people to sign up through the link below, Skillshare is offering you free access to their entire library for a full month, so be sure to check it out. Once you have recorded the video, visit this website called HeyGen. You can find a direct link in the description box. Personally, I went for the creator plan and I find that 180 credits per year are quite enough for now. Once you're logged in, navigate to video avatar. In the top right corner, click on new video avatar. And from the drop down list, choose instant avatar. Then click on get started. You will be shown two avatar styles to choose from and because my video doesn't have much movement and the background is static, I'm choosing the still option. Now we're asked to select between video or text instructions, but if you've already got your video filmed, you can proceed to the next step. Click on upload footage and simply drag and drop your video here. Afterwards, make sure your video meets all the requirements. To retain a bit more natural audio, turn on ambient sound. You can also use this tool to change the background or enable 4K resolution. However, these features come with pricier premium plans, so I'll show you later the alternative tool that I use to upscale and enhance the quality of my avatar videos. After checking the boxes, click on my footage looks good. Now you will be asked to record a short video of yourself to confirm your identity. I think this is a fantastic safety feature to ensure no one can create avatars of others without their consent. Click on record with webcam and simply follow the instructions on how to record the consent video and what to say. After that, hit submit. Wait for your video to upload. You can click here to track the progress of your avatar creation. Once it's ready, click on the video. There will be a short demo that you can play to preview your avatar. So let's take a look. Your instant avatar is ready. Try creating videos with it. Also, click the feedback button to share what you think. Hope you enjoy. Now this is amazing. It's really impressive how it mimics my motion. And for me, the best part is the blinking and lip movement. It just looks so realistic and natural. I'm really impressed and I'd love to hear what you guys think in the comments below. Now let's make our avatar say something different. To do that, click on create with AI studio. 
On the left side menu, click on script. Here you can manually replace the default text with any dialogue you want. You also have the option to upload an existing audio file or record your own real voice for a more natural result. Also, GPT-4 is integrated here, so you can use it to assist with script creation. You can add a new script by going over here and pressing enter. Add whatever text you want your avatar to say. And if you click here, you will see some voice settings that you can adjust. You can also translate parts of the script or the entire dialogue to a different language. We will test that together in a moment, but before that, let's go to the timeline and extend the video layer to align with the audio duration. You can click here to preview the result, but note that you will only hear the audio without the video. Once you're satisfied with how the script is voiced, click on submit. You will see the credit cost here and you can confirm by clicking on submit and wait for the video to process. When it's ready, click on the video to play it. Hey there world, I'm MDMZ's digital AI avatar and you can create yours too. Perhaps you've got a message you want to share with the world, but who's got time to set up cameras, lights, and do multiple takes. That's where your avatar comes in. All I can say is that this technology is a real game changer. I'm going to try and use this a lot to create YouTube shorts and produce more video content with less effort. To save the video, simply choose a resolution and click on download original video. Now let's say you want to translate the same video into a different language and keeping the same custom AI voice. Simply click on translate select one or more target languages and enable the translate script option. Then click on translate. You will be redirected to the AI studio, refresh this page, open the draft tab and open the most recent avatar video. As we did before, you can make additional edits to your script. And once you're satisfied with the audio preview, click on submit to generate the translated video. Hola mundo, soy el avatar digital de IA de MDMZ y tú también puedes crear el tuyo. Quizás tengas un mensaje que quieras compartir con el mundo, pero ¿quién tiene tiempo para configurar cámaras, luces y realizar múltiples tomas? Ahí es donde entra tu avatar. I'm also preparing another tutorial where I'll show you how to translate real videos into different languages using HeyGen. I don't think wealth and, and genetics have anything to do with each other. Si vous êtes né aux États-Unis, la condition de votre naissance n'a vraiment pas d'importance. As you could see, the voice matching and lip movement accuracy are truly impressive. I will link the tutorial down below once it's live, so make sure you check it out. Now, as I mentioned earlier, if you don't enable downloading in 4K resolution, you might end up with a low quality output. To fix this, I usually use a software called Topaz Video AI, which drastically enhances the quality of low resolution videos. Here's how to use it. Start by importing the footage, then choose an upscaling ratio. Let's go with 4K. Then you need to select an AI model. I usually go with the Artemis model. After that, you can edit the export settings and finally click on export. By using Topaz Video AI, you will notice a huge improvement in terms of sharpness and overall video quality. I hope you found this video useful and easy to follow. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a like to help boost its visibility. Stay creative and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.